Host Jimmy Kimmel went on stage to set the political tone of the show 50 days before America right elects its so next president. Many have asked, who is to blame for Donald Trump, the Donald Trump phenomenon? And I'll tell you who, because he's sitting right there. That's right, that guy. <laughs> Mark Burnett, the man who brought us Celebrity Apprentice. Thanks to Mark Burnett. We don't have to watch reality shows anymore because we're living in one. Thank you, Mark. Burnett, the producer of Celebrity Apprentice, who later accepted the Best Reality Series Emmy for The Voice, joked on stage in response to Jimmy's statement. Thank you so much. I want to let you know that Hillary Clinton called me in the last few minutes so that I would personally thank Jimmy Kimmel for an extra free five minutes of ABC network publicity for Donald Trump. As the show went on, highlighting the Game night was Thrones. the big win. HBO fantasy drama Game of Thrones triumphed in 12 categories, including for directing and writing, taking its all-time Emmy total to 38 and surpassing Frasier's record of 37. They know I am loyal, as do I. I am loyal to my queen, not you. Your generosity is overwhelming. Uh, and so this is oh, seriously? This is Veep won the outstanding comedy series imagine. award for the second or year in a row, while its star Julia Louis Dreyfus won outstanding lead comedy actress for the fifth time. As the win predictions were on point, there were surprise wins for people who led the drama series categories. Egyptian-American Rami Malek took home his first Emmy for Best Drama Actor for playing a socially inept computer hacker in Mr. Robot, while Canadian Tatiana Maslany took home Best Actress in Drama Series for playing a woman with multiple cloned personalities in Orphan Black. Oh, that puts women at the center. Sarah Paulson. <laughs>